Hi, it's Miss Rhonda. Glad to see you again. I want to read you a story about the pout pout fish and a pout pout fish has the worst best day ever. Let's hear about it. Pout pout fish is asleep, but it's a school day. So the alarm's going off. Ding, 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 ding. Uh, br -br 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 -br. Turn that off. Br -br -br -br. You guessed it. If you turn off your alarm, you oversleep. So pout pout fish oversleeps and now he's in a hurry. He gets up and he quickly puts his clothes on and he looks for his backpack here and there and here and there. Finds it underneath the dirty laundry. Yuck! So he gets his backpack and then he goes in and has his breakfast and he's eating it. But oh, he has to eat so fast he can't even enjoy the good meal. This is not a good day. And he rushes outside and there's so much traffic. He's getting dizzy and Sunny comes up and goes, hi. And he goes, blah, 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 blah. She goes, what's wrong? He goes, come on, let's hurry to school together. We'll get to school before we're late. He said, blah, 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 blah. Pop -pop fish doesn't think they're going to make it on time. Well, he was right. They didn't make it on time. And the principal met them at the door and said, hmm, you're late. And pout, pout, fish, boom, 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 boom. and the principal said, okay, don't be late tomorrow. And so Sonny goes, oh, we promise, we promise we won't be late tomorrow. And they go in and Sonny's ready for a good day. The teacher is too. The teacher's all ready to talk to the class and wants to discuss the uh, discuss their morning. And pout, pout, fish goes, oh, boom, 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 let's not, so let's not do that. Later on, it is art time, and Sunny does her art, and she doesn't like it very much, and Pout Pout Fish doesn't like his either. But Sunny says, hey, I think yours looks better than mine, and she has a smile on her face. It's time for recess. And so they go outside and the ball hits Sunny and she slides on the sand and she has scrapes and she's brushing herself off and everybody's watching, but she gets up and she doesn't cry. She says, oh, I'm okay. But the recess teacher says, you better go have it checked. So she went to the nurse and they put a bandage around her face, but she said, it's okay, I'm feeling better. And that pop pop fish just went blah, 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 blah. So now it's time for um, lunch, and Sunny's looking for her lunch. She looks in her backpack again, and again, and again. It's gone. Sunny doesn't have her lunch. And so Pop Pop Fish goes, oh, buh, 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 buh. and he happily shares half of his with Sunny. Well, Sunny was very thankful to, for, to Pop Pop Fish for sharing. At the end of the day, when it's time to go home, Pop Pop Fish says, oh, this was the worst day ever. And Sonny said, why? I think it was the best day ever. Pout Pout Fish goes, how can it be the best day ever? We were late for school. You didn't like your art. You got hurt at recess. You didn't have your lunch. And Sonny said, that's right but I met a new friend in you. So I think it's the best worst day ever. And Pout Pout Fish went, that's right, it is the best worst day ever. <laughs> that's a really cute story. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope you know too, that it says in Romans eight twenty eight that all things work together for good. God makes all things work together for good. And so whenever you're having your very bad, awful day, I want you to remember that God can make it work out for good. As we get older, that verse gets more complicated. But now in preschool, we need to know the truth that God works things out for us. And we are so thankful. Deborah Deason's the one who wrote this book. And in her biography, it says that she loves to rhyme. She did not rhyme in this book, but she rhymes in most of her books. And so she practices rhyming all day long. So I thought that might be kind of fun for you to rhyme. Maybe you can say, ah, oh, I feel like I want to eat. Mommy, may I have a treat? <laughs> That's a rhyme. So, all right, I have to go now. I'm going to go ride my cow. No, I'm not. I have to go now. I need to buy a towel. No, I really don't. 
I have to go now, so I will take a bow. <laughs> bye bye. Eat some pie. <laughs>